What's the crack lads? Welcome back to the channel. We're back with a messy pack. Big time messy. Three of the best messy cards they've ever released. Three of probably the best big time cards they've ever released. Three very different versions of Messi from throughout his career. But a lot has changed since this pack was released way back when. So we're going to show you updated builds, the best skills to give for the new updated gameplay. And whether or not these messy packs are now worth it. Let's find out. All right, boys, so this is the Messi pack. It's a trio of big time Messi cards. They've all got plus four booster. I think this is this is a good pack as well if you are looking to spin. It is a fairly decent pack if you are definitely going to go for a version of Messi. I feel like we're going to start with the best version of him. Deep line forward, very easy to get used to. Very nice card. He's going to have the King of Football plus four booster, which will give a plus four to dribble and tie possession, physical contact and balance. This is probably the best pound for pound, stat for stat card in the game. I know that Romario will push him close. I know Rijkaard will push him close. But in terms of his player ID and his player, his player AI, this Messi is phenomenal, especially if you get used to playing with a deep line forward. And this is from level one. He's got 34 levels to go. All that you need to do with Messi, with this version of Messi, is play him as a CF and has him, have him as your main guy through the middle. You will be able to score some beautiful goals with him. Brilliant feet, brilliant trickery, brilliant finishing on either foot. Lovely little roulette here and bang with the right foot into the corner of the net. No chance for the keeper and Messi does it again. This version of Messi is phenomenal, lads. He's probably my favorite one to use. They're all different, but this one I still keep going back to him. The second version of Messi is a creative playmaker. So when you see a creative playmaker, you are going to be playing him through the middle. You know, he's going to have the Son of God plus four booster, and that's going to give a plus four to his dribbling, his low pass, his finishing, and his kicking power. So it is a really nice card. The one weakness of this card, even though he's got 33 levels, is his speed and stamina. But that's not a massive concern when you're playing a player through the middle, either as an SS creative playmaker or as an AMF creative playmaker. Now, of course, you can train him up any which way you want, but I'm going to show you the best build at the end of the video for all of these cards. And I'm going to show you one in the live stream as well and go into a bit of detail and test them all out today because I know people will be interested. But again, where you're gone from this card here, you can still finish with Messi. You can still stop on a dime and quickly accelerate. This is where his strengths really do lie is being able to cut in from the right or starting him as an AMF and being able to kind of like naturally kind of roam out right or left depending on your play style and your tactics. And then last but not least, speaking of Roman players, we have got Roman flank Leo Messi as well. This is the youngest version of the Messi cards. It's 21 years of age. And of course, we do remember his iconic matches that he would have had around this time. He was a phenomenal player when he was starting off. The bearer of fate, plus four to speed and acceleration. And the rest of his stats that are going to be really nice as well. I think it's more a case of using this Messi for tight dribbling and stretching the pitch really fast, really, really, really rapid on the ball and off the ball he's got the boot kiss celebration of course as well and just a phenomenal player as well but I would definitely be using him as my speedster and my dribbler out wide I wouldn't be playing him through the middle and again as you see there very nice player skills he has double touch and soul control from the rip so you only need to give him a, a flip flap and you will have ball roll and he's got one touch pass he's got long range curler long range shooting I'll show you the builds at the end of the video, lads, but honestly, finishing, heading, speed and acceleration plus four with this booster, it is going to be very, very nice with this Messi card. This is probably my second favorite one because it's just raw pace, and that's where the game is at at the moment, a lot of the time out wide. Simple touch and go and hope that the AI tracks off, tracks off a little bit or, or, or knocks off a little bit so that you can get past him. Now, I'm going to show you the three best versions of Messi. We've already showed you a goal scored with each of them in their best positions and how they go. This is Messi with the new Guardiola. So you're going to be getting the manager boost with the ADA playstyle proficiency. Xabi Alonso will be the same. These are Messi's stats. 103 dribbling, 104 tie possession, 90 plus in pretty much everything you could possibly want. This is his training that we've given him with the new updated gameplay. 818, 11, 10, 2, and nothing into the rest. It's a phenomenal card, lads. Definitely one of the cards that will just absolutely rip it up for you. Messi has been nor nerfed a little bit over the last few weeks, but I think he's going to be back now. We also have right wing Messi as well, the Roman flank. This is the 21-year-old Messi, as you have seen earlier in the video. This is a phenomenal right winger as well. If you are able to spin, you're going to get a 91 balance, 103 acceleration, and 90 finishing with the rest of his dribbling stats. Really nice as well. One into shooting, zero into passing, 14, 12. And of course, we have four into lower body, 14 and 12 into the dexterity are the big two stats here. Balance, acceleration, finishing, 
tight possession, dribbling, ball control, attacking awareness, speed, pretty much everything at 90. Um, if you are using Ten Hag, you will get that 90 boost as well. We're getting an extra boost with Pep, obviously. We've given him flip-flap, of course. We're going to have that ball roll or advanced special touch, double touch, whatever you want to call it. Phenomenal card. Absolutely unreal card. And last but not least, we are going to look at attacking midfielder Messi. Now, I'm going to do and build this card. We have him trained up. I'm going to build this card in real time on the live stream in a little bit for you guys because I know a lot of people have been asking me about creative playmaker Messi. You know, how do you actually use him? Because he doesn't have that speed or stamina that the other cards have. But it's not... A really big problem. Now the one thing with this Messi card is he has phenomenal low pass and dribbling straight off the rip at level 1 with Guardiola and with his booster. This is kind of an also a concern with the speed. Now we've thrown flip flap on him, we're waiting for soul control to give him ball roll, but we definitely would like to have a couple of more passing and shooting skills on him for the way I play. Low lofted pass is definitely one. But that is the three versions of Messi. It is a re-release as I said. What do you guys think? Obviously, they're going to be starting to release cards that they've had before. I reckon we could definitely see Blitz Curler come back or maybe an updated card like that. I definitely feel that this messy pack, lads, will probably, it was probably their most, probably their most, like, profitable pack because I know pretty much everybody that was playing the game at the time was going deep for Messi. Uh, we were lucky enough to get three of them and clear the pack pretty much. Um, but yeah, it's... it's. Listen, Messi is Messi, man. You know what you're going to be getting with him depending on how you train him up and where you play him. But let me know if you spun or if you're going to skip and I will see you in the live stream.